and hello again. Yeah, the other plant that I wanted to do an update on is the Edith Colia grandis, which is another succulent from Africa. I think it's also from the island of Socotra as well and uh, the uh, Arabian Peninsula. But uh, this one has really cool flowers, so hopefully I can get this guy to bloom and I can actually show you my flowers instead of just posting pictures in this video, which I will do to show you the flowers. This is a really, really cool guy. Um, and everyone has told me this is too hard to grow here in Florida. Fooey. I don't believe it. And when I got it, when I got this plant, it was no more than this. So, and I got that one the same time I got the Duvalandria uh, Dioscoridus. So, anyway, uh, this thing has jumped leaps and bounds. I do not give it a whole lot of sun. I give it kind of like the light I give my orchids. Actually, I grow this plant with my orchids uh, hanging in the tree. Um, and I grow it in the same mix that my frankincense grows on, um, grows in rather um yeah i just slurped down some coffee so i'm doing a little better this morning <laughs> so anyway but i have found this plant to be rather easy to grow um it's not giving me any fusses or fits and uh, likes to be a little bit on the dry side uh, especially during the cold months if you uh, mix cold and wet with this guy you're going to get rot so anything below 60 cut the water um, on it Cut that water off any temps below 60 degrees so but uh, it loves the heat it actually likes water so uh, good luck finding this because I've been looking for another one and you know I find seeds for it but I'm not gonna pay seven eight dollars for three seeds for this thing I'll just wait for mine to bloom and see if it gets pollinated or I will start taking cuttings off mine once it gets a bit bigger so anyway uh you folks enjoy your day and uh like i said i'll post some pictures of what the flower of this looks like until of course i get some of my own and uh, stay tuned for that and i want to say thanks to all the new subscribers i really appreciate you subscribing um i know some of you guys are uh water lily and lotus fans and um, all that and orchid bands and we'll get into some more orchids and stuff like that I think this month I'm going to get a couple orchids and maybe a couple more frankincense trees. We'll see um, I'm not gonna do any lotus yet until next year new lotus that is or water lilies But anyway you folks enjoy your day and uh, thanks for subscribing and happy growing. Bye. Bye